Hello and welcome back to lesson five. Yet another segment of lesson five is removing objects using the content aware fill. And this is uh, what we're going to remove. You see this rock in the middle? We're going to totally get rid of it, including the shadow in the water and the up portion. But what we're going to do is we're going to use our lasso tool. I'm going to zoom in a little bit closer to this particular rock. And we are going to select it with a lasso tool. And I'm trying to select it as best as I can in a short amount of time. And here we go, almost done. Bring it right back to the starting point and it is selected. Now, all we have to do is go to edit and go to content aware fill. Now there's a couple of options. There's the auto. If we select the auto, we give it a few seconds. This is how it looks, a little blurry, not that bad. We can do a rectangular shape, wait for it to complete, and better. Or we can do the custom. The custom is basically allows us to select the area we want to use as a fill. So let me go ahead and zoom out. Also notice that you can change the color that you're drawing with. I'm going to use the brush tool and I'm going to select this area that I'm going to use as a fill. All the way around. And basically I'm just painting to tell the computer which area I want to use as a fill. When I stop painting, notice how it gives me a preview of what it's going to look like. I like that much better. So I'm going to click OK and watch my, my island, little island disappear. Oh, that looks pretty good. I just don't like these two areas. So I can go ahead and maybe, so let me see if I can use a different tool, like a healing brush tool to fix that. First of all, let me go ahead and unlock the layer and see if I can fix it or make it worse. Looks like I'm making it a little bit worse. So let me see. There we go. Let me go ahead. How about that? Does that look good? It looks really nicely. What I was doing is basically using some other tools like the healing brush tool that we learned about to get rid of some of these artifacts that make your eye jump to that area and say something's wrong. And notice the layer I'm modifying, which is this rock layer. And that is it. That is our content aware fill tool.